Today on MT Jam Packed, it's time for another Commander Snack. So this is the series where we highlight a different legendary creature each episode, and then we go digging through the packs here, looking for creatures of the same tribe. So let's introduce today's patron. We have Justice Catron. Thank you for being a patron. Let's take a look at your Commander today. So we have Chevel Bane of Monsters. It's a mythic. It's a 1-3 for 2 legendary creature, human rogue with death touch. At the beginning of your upkeep, if your opponents control no permanents with bounty counters on them, put a bounty counter on target creature or planeswalker an opponent controls. And whenever a permanent an opponent controls with a bounty counter on it dies, you gain 3 life and draw a card. And I believe this was the one we had in the Golgari Poison deck. I'll chuck a link in the corner, check it out. So it's from Ikoria. Alright, so we're looking for humans and rogues today. And the patrons get the rares, mythic spoils and anything over a buck. Okay, so let's get into it. Starting off with Kaldheim. It's a set booster, and for the set boosters, I'm also checking in the art cards uh, and anything from the list. Okay, so I think this is Cole, the Forge Master. It is indeed. All right. I also throw in the Ice Tunnel. Got these Snowlands there. Augury Raven. Raven form, Carfil Harbinger, Depart the Realm, Mistwalker, and this one sometimes tricks me, but not today. Creature Shapeshifter, 1 4 for 3, has Changeling, so that means this card is every creature type, which also means it's a human rogue, has flying for 1 and a blue, it gets plus 1, minus 1 until end of turn. So we'll throw that over here. Shimmer Drift Veil. Call the Forge Master, there is again Rune of Mortality, Draugr Necromancer, Grim Draugr, and a foil Doomscar Titan, along with a strictly better magic minigame. Okay, so are we missing? Okay, I just went right past it. So this is apparently the rare. The symbol bypassed me, okay, so we've got Draugr, Necromancer, Snow Creature, Zombie Cleric, 4 4 4 4. If a non token creature an opponent controls would die, exile that card with an ice counter on it instead. You may cast spells from among cards and exile your opponent's own with ice counters on them, and you may spend mana from snow sources as a mana of any color to cast those spells. Okay, so there we go. Bit of a mishap there, but we caught it in time, and there are no humans or rogues in there other than the shapeshifter. On to Theros Beyond Death, and we're in the uh, disintegrating pack territory apparently. Alright, we have Triumphant Surge, Starlit Mantle, Hero of the Games. Here we go, Creature Human Soldier 323. One of you cast a spell that targets hero of the game's creatures to control get plus one plus zero until end of turn. Omen of the Hunt, Omen of the Dead, Myers Grasp, Rumbling Sentry, Witness of Tomorrow's Elysian Caryatid, Towering Wave Mystic, Mischievous Chimera, Rise to Glory, Destiny Spinner. So this is an enchantment creature human two three for two. Creature and enchantment spells you control can't be counted. Nice. For three and a green, target land you control becomes an XX elemental creature with trample and haste until end of turn. Where X is the number of enchantments you control, it's still a land. And the rare is Underworld Breach. Enchantment for two. Each non-land card in your graveyard has escape. The escape cost is equal to the card's mana cost plus exile three other cards from your graveyard. And at the beginning of the end step, Sacrifice Underworld Breach. Alright, that's a decent one. And a Forest, I'll throw that in as well. And we've got a Spider Token. On to Core 2021. And if we get too many humans, I think I'll just uh, skip reading them in the interest of time. Okay, so we have a Pirate Token. That's pretty awesome. I'll throw that in just because. Dismal Backwater. And the rare conspicuous snoop. 
Creature Goblin Rogue. Two two for two. Play with the top card of your library revealed. You may cast goblin spells from the top of your library, and as long as the top card of your library is a goblin card, Conspicuous Snoop has all activated abilities of that card, and I believe he made the cut in my historic goblins deck. If you missed that video, I'll check a link in the corner. So he is a rogue as well, so that fits in with the commander today. Chandra's Piling. Bad deal. Talarian Kraken. And he commons Lanawar Visionary Masked Blackguard. So there's a human guard. We'll chuck that in. Or human rogue, I should say. Fuhrer of the Bitten. Frost Breath. Warded Battlements. Walking Corpse. Pride Malkin. Hobble Fiend. Cancel. And secure the scene. And if you missed yesterday's video, holy moly. There was a crazy pack indeed. I'll we'll check a link in the corner to that one. You will not want to miss that. I think that also went in the greatest hits playlist. Okay, Zendikar Rising. I have no idea what I'm looking at here, but it's got one of those Hedron things. Seachrome Coast. Okay, throw that in. Foil Swamp. Nice. Full Art. Gnarled Colony. Royal Eruption. Scorch Rider. Creature Human Warrior. Blood Beckoning, Cleric of Life Spawned, Relic Vial, Spitfire, Lagak Showcase, Paired Tactician, Human Warrior, Thundering Rebuke, and the rare is Inscription of Abundance. It's an instant for two. Kicker, two and a green. Choose one if the spell was kicked. Choose any number instead. Put two plus one plus one counters on target creature. Target player gains X life where X is the greatest power among creatures they control, or target creature control fights target creature. You don't control and a foil prowling felidar and nothing from the list in that one. Okay, on to Ikoria, which is Chevel's home plane here. At least that's what I believe. He is in the set, so we we will see if we get another one. Forbidden friendship, snare tactician, human soldier of one mind, Drana Stinger, human wizard. Add it to the pile. Humble Naturalist, Human Druid, Mutual Destruction, Fully Grown, Boot Nipper, Adaptive Shimmerer, Chris Station, Hornbash Mentor, Human Warrior for the Uncommons, Ivy Elemental, Ketria Crystal, and rare is Frondland Felidar, Creature Cat Beast, 3 5 for 4, with Vigilance, Creatures you control with Vigilance have Pay 1, Tap, Tap Target Creature. And a forest, and nothing there. All right, just one of those punch out cards. One more pack to crack. And I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button for more Magic the Gathering unboxings, and be sure to tap the notification bell to be notified as soon as new videos are released. Okay, see so if we can open the pack there. So we have Shale, Dean of Radiance. So let's check it out. What is it? Which one is that? Okay, is that the the bird owl dude? I guess so. Okay, we get a foil planes containment breach for the lesson crushing disappointment. Lash of malice, rise of Exodus, mage hunters onslaught, defend the campus, campus guide, rip apart. Actually, that one. I think it's still over a buck, I'll throw that in. And the rare is Draconic Intervention. Sorcery for four as an additional cost to cast a spell, exile an instant or sorcery card from your graveyard. Draconic Intervention deals X damage to each non-dragon creature where X is the exile card's mana value. If a creature dealt damage this way, would die this turn, exile it instead, exile Draconic Intervention and claim the firstborn for the Mystical Archive. Foil Stonebound Mentor. And that is it. Okay, so scooping up the huge pile of humans here for justice. Enjoy the pools today and stay tuned. Later in the month, we will have the patron snap pack for May. So it's a fun live stream. We put together the patron snap packs. Always a fun time. Hope everyone's staying safe and healthy out there. Thanks for watching and have a great day.